Mammograms save lives by detecting breast cancer while it's in its most treatable stage, but mammograms may be able to detect more than cancer. Dr. McGeorge is here with promising new research that shows a mammogram could also help detect heart disease without any change in the way they're done or any extra cost. Mammography has really reached a new level of detail. The images captured usually show areas with extra calcium deposits. Now, depending on their appearance, they can suggest an early cancer. They can be harmless. Or if they are in the arteries of the breast, they can suggest a problem with calcifications in other areas of the body, like the heart. We typically do see breast arterial calcifications not uncommonly on, on screening mammograms. Dr. Sabala Mandava is a specialist in breast imaging and a vice chair of radiology in the Henry Ford Health System. When we see extensive breast arterial calcifications in women under the age of 60 on screening mammograms, that uh, triggers a little warning bell um, because we tend to not see it as commonly in younger women. That warning bell suggests there may be a higher risk of coronary artery disease in those younger women. Now, a new study in the American Heart Association journal Circulation wanted to know if the same concern about breast arterial calcifications would hold in older women. Here's why. They are very common in older women, and certainly there is going to be a range. You know, some will have a few, some will have a lot more. But with our current data, we don't know what that means. After looking at the routine screening mammograms of over 5,000 women between 60 and 79, the researchers found the presence of significant breast arterial calcification was associated with a 51% higher chance of having heart disease, a huge potential extra value to having a mammogram. On top of this now, if we're saying that we can even quantify how much risk there is for cardiovascular disease in women, which oftentimes tends to go underreported and underrecognized, then you know this is all the more reason to get a screening mammogram. If we can certainly show that yes, 50% um, arterial breast arterial calcifications, for example, will show an increased risk, then certainly that is a game changer. Now I know personally when I'm looking at a CAT scan or an x-ray, we often see other things that we weren't looking for that can help a patient in the long run. And this is really a great example of that. Now more research does need to be done to figure out exactly how much arterial calcification is significant. And I should point out, not having breast arterial calcifications does not mean you might not still have heart disease, but this is one advancement that adds more value to something we already do. Back to you. All right, Doc, yeah.